Okay, here's a special video for all mums trying to put trams and cars that have back injuries. So we've got Kim and her car and her babies in the car seat. We're going to try and show you how to put a pram like this, which is a four-wheel pram, which is one of the most hardest prams, into a car without wrecking your back. And this is really important lifting-wise if you've had a back injury and to prevent a back injury to do it properly. So what I suggest you do is you don't put down the pram and try and lift it in. So the worst thing you can do is put this pram down and try and lift it like this. It's too heavy, okay? And that's when people wreck their back. So what you do is keep the pram like this, okay? Keep it all set up. And you put the, the pram handle in first. Now you're going to have to do a squat. But what you're not doing is lifting the whole pram. You're using a bit of leverage of that. Once it's in the back of the car, then we'll fold it down. So here, this is where you need to get that nice wide stance. Go into just a half the squat, nice and easy. There's no pressure on the back here. I'm just going to take this part of the pram, and so the car is going to take the weight. Lift it up, and do a simple little squat like that. This little squat, like and then keep it into there. Okay. Now at this point here, then what you do with this sort of pram is it folds down the legs. Okay. So. I'm going to then click one side, fold it down, okay, and then come around and click the other side and fold it down. So now I've got my pram unlocking. The best thing to do then, just tilt it on its side. So I'm still not lifting, I'm just rolling it because the weight of the pram is on the car. And then just fold it in like that. And hey, presto, okay? So the pram's in the back of the car. Now, you also got to get out. So what I suggest you do is you do the exact reverse. Um, don't lift the pram again. Use the weight of it, or use the car as leverage. So just roll the pram back out to the side again. So again, I'm not lifting the pram at all. I then click it back out so it's sitting there on its side. And then you just simply roll it to where it was, hold it there, and just let it come in. Okay? Easy, easy. All right? So, to prove that, we're going to get Kim to do that and show you that it's not just me being clever, Kim can do it as well. Okay, so we're going to get Kim to show us how to do it. Away you go, Kim. So she's got to squat, very mighty end, use the leverage of the pram there, and it goes. And the hardest part is actually clicking it down. So she's got to hold one end, click it down there. Okay, she comes around this front here, make sure she holds it, she's not lifting still clicks the other one down, and then she rolls it onto its side, over it goes, and then she pushes it in, okay? Now the easiest thing about that is she stayed upright the whole time, which means she hasn't bent forward and lifted it out of the pram, out of the car. So to get it out again, she's not gonna lift it out, she's going to just click it, stabilize it, roll onto its bum, again, she's not lifting, she's staying nice and upright, and she holds on the back handle, and, Way to go. So it's using the weight and the gravity of the pram as the leverage. See how you go.